Alright, episode 5, I think. Don't quote me on that. Loading game. And continuing game. Okay, so this is going to be a little bit of back and forth in this mouse town. Uh, as I have to take care of a bunch of little things. So give me a second. Alright. Let me find the hedgehogs again. I figured out what to do for them. Meaning I looked it up in a walkthrough. Nope, not here. Here we go. Now I'm supposed to nice saw. Pointy teeth. I have to uh, find these guys as tools. use my magical device. Oh, somebody's there. A little green man with a hat. I knew it! We've had a green hat in the house after all. Ah, may the snakes take me. Jolly cats and fly specks. Hail and mud puddles. He can see me, but not if I hold me breath. What the fuck? Well, what do I do what? about that? Stop! Oh no, the thief is gone. I have to go after him. How do I do that? <sighs> Checking the journal. A little man dressed in a green has snaffled the Hedgehog Brothers tools. The door to the Wood Dwarf's residence is locked. There's another way to reach their home. Play so good in the, the mail today. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. I don't know how to follow that guy. Examine the green footprints. Ah, green footprints. Ah, the footprints lead to the little tunnel between the roots. No, I just don't fit. Instead of following the little guy, I could try to block his way. Little man in green. There he is again. Ah, first at the hedgehogs, and now here. You've got the wrong man. I've done nothing confounded, Billy's. Ah, I mean, go to the weevil, cursed constable. Goodness. What do I do He's about gone that? Again. He seemed pretty angry. Huh. Give me a second. Flagstone. It says, use the rake on the flagstone with clover leaf. Maybe I'm not in the right spot. not where I thought I'd be.
This is starting to piss me off. Oh, he means on that thing. Ha! The Shadrach Ripper certainly won't find me here. There he is again. Stop. Ha! I'm standing on a Shamrock. It's magic. It gives me strength. I, I can do whatever I like here. He got away again. Using the rake on the flagstone. That's a cunning plan, and it might just work. I don't know what it is. Oh, I see. And then what do I do? I gotta chase him again. Oh. Game that dares to ask, will he Johnny catch Hawks the leprechaun? Leave me in peace, you brat. You'll never get me, Shamrock. Take your time. is again. You've got the wrong man. I've done nothing confounded, Billy. He's gone again. pop up at any moment and then Hedgehog brothers, they'll sure be glad to get their tools back. I just beat the fuck out of a leprechaun. Johnny Cocks and Fly Specs! Leave me in peace, you brat! You'll never get me Shamrock! Well, I don't need to anymore. I got the tools. Why would I chase them again? Here's your tools. I've got your tools. Terrific! But. As long as the green ass is still about, I'm not happy about finishing building the boat. Me neither. Please make it go away. Oh man. Now what do I gotta do? Like I'm supposed to lost see that. Of wood. It'll be okay. We'll find your mummy. Put the wood over that hole. That's music to my ears. The unmistakable sound of our tools. The tunnel is closed.
All right. So what do we do? That leprechaun will never get past that one little board. There he is again. You've got the wrong man. I've done nothing. Confounded, Billy. He's gone again. A lot more back and forth than I actually anticipated. again. Stop. Ha! I'm standing on a shamrock. It's magic. It gives me strength. I, I can do whatever <coughs> I like here. He got away again. And fly specs. Leave me in peace, you brat. You'll never get me shamrock. Ouch! Nail shot. Fine. Be that way. What a waste of a day. Ah, off home to warm heart. Shamrock Ripper won't find me there. Okay. The footprints lead to the top of the pumpkin. Hmm. Hold on. Is that a chimney? I knew there was something strange about it. Ever done to you? Oh, uh, I, I didn't mean to do that. Um, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to? That was negligent vandalism. You're after me, cobalt, cobalt. Actually, I was just here about the stolen stuff. <laughs> well, that's me cue. Till we never meet again, you schnoop. And he's gone. This is starting to get frustrating. Has a green hat really gone? Oh, what a relief. It looks kind of sad when it's so empty. I was just trying to catch the thief, but I didn't want this to happen. It was a nice little house. Well, pumpkin, pumpkin house. The spoon and the silvery lump are probably stolen too. Anyway, Inspector well, they are now. has secured the stolen goods. It's over. The green hat is gone. Ah, oh, I am so relieved. Dad was right after all. He was living in a pumpkin with the chimney the whole time. I wondered about that. Ah, and you have our tools. Come on, brother. We better get to work. <laughs> the leaf boat for Spitzweg is ready. Ready to put to sea. And how do we get it to Mr. Spitzweg? Just give it a little push. Oh, but... Don't worry. The cold water brook will take the boat to the catfish barry, where Spitzkeg is already waiting. <laughs> okay. If you say so. We still have a lot to do. 
We need to get back to work. We still have to renovate an antique cabinet for our neighbour. Ah, that'll be fun. Oh, I love furniture. But make sure you don't sand too deep this time. Yeah, yeah. What's this say? It doesn't say, but... Gee, this is a lot of shit I gotta do. I'm starting to lose track of it. I like this piece of music. I don't know if you can hear it. I turned it up. I turned the music up from last episode. Because I couldn't hear it. Alright. Pumpkin stash? It looks kind of sad when it's so empty. I was just trying to catch the thief. But I didn't want this to happen. It was a nice little house. Well, pumpkin. Pumpkin house. Alright, we're gonna use the magical letter on the mailbox. You've got mail. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. <laughs> that was weird. Huh? Who said that? I'm heading to the cafe. that empty envelope for some reason. What else do I got to do in here? Oh yeah. Coffee machine. He gave me that mug. Use that on the coffee machine. One hot coffee. Too bad I don't like coffee. Heading to the party guest. giving the party guests the coffee. How does that sound? I'll give him some of my coffee. I'm awake. I'm so grateful to you. Take this. You found a quartet's card. To see your collection, open the inventory game menu and click on bonus collection. Without you, I would have been late for work. Right. Oh. <sighs> All right. Now what? Oh, let's go to the city wall. Talk to this guy. Oh, 
Excellent! The boat is here! In all my travels over the years, I've realized again and again that you can find kind people no matter where you go. Just as long as you never give up and always travel with an open heart. Yeah, I should whatever. write that down. It sounds like a motto for my journey. Now I can finally put out to sea. Way anchor. Set the sail. Man the oars. Aye, aye, sir. Uh, oars? Oars! We had better not set up rudderless. Water is much too unpredictable. You can't rely on chance to take you where you want to go. And to be sure your ship doesn't try to leave without you when you go ashore, you also need an anchor. But as long as the catfish is swimming outside the barrier, we can't even think about setting off. The world offers enough adventure. We don't need to go looking for trouble, you know. So we can't set sail until we've got an anchor and a rudder, and the brook here is free of loitering catfish, right? Yes, and then our great journey will begin. Hmm. Or so we hope. Alright, we're going to use... Wait for it. Where is it? Oh man, I think I'm missing something. It says... The Valerian Drops. Where do I get the Valerian Drops? Valerian Drops. Oh man, hang on. Oh. Well, I'm gonna have to find it, find out where those Valerian drops are. All right, Silver Spoon. Good idea. There. That's exactly what we need. An excellent rudder. Now all we need is an anchor. But as long as the catfish is swimming outside the barrier, we can't even think about setting off. Well, once I've done that, we get started, right? Yes, and then our great journey yeah, will be... If begin. I remember where the hell to get we'll the valerian drops. Valerian drops. Where was that? I'm looking. Man, I don't know where I'm supposed to get those things. I guess I'll just keep doing some other shit until I chance upon them or something. Give me a second. Damn it. I gotta find these Valerian drops. How could I be missing something? I'm following a fucking walkthrough.
damn. Great. Wait, what's this? Another drop. Yay. Oh, Valerian drops. Is it in the cafe? <gasps> Valerian drops. Uli's nightcap, sleeping drops. It says a bottle costs one leaf buck, but I only have one. One single leaf buck. Well. Good. Well, crisis solved. I thought I was going to have to pack it in early or something. Let's give these valerian drops to the catfish. And good night. What did you just put in the water? Uh, me? Oh, uh, nothing. Something that makes little mice sleepy couldn't harm a gigantic catfish. Well, at least I hope. <laughs> That's Spitzwake's traditional mousewood leaf boat. He said I could travel with him, but it looks like we still can't cast off. Is it the nail? No, I'd better be careful with the thing. Oh, uh, the grappling hook? No, I'd better be careful with the thing. <gasps> that is a perfect anchor. Oh, ho, ho. outstanding, first mate. Please open the barrier by pressing the lever over there. Here? It looks like you can open the barrier from here. Either that, or fire off a couple of rockets. Let's give it a try. Oh, well done! I shall defer to you on the maiden voyage of our good ship Goldleaf. Our cast off starboard port, make him walk the plank. Oh, my God. On second thoughts, I should probably take command. You can still be my first mate, though. Man, I need a parrot on my shoulder who just agrees with everything I say. Then I would be captain. That's funny. Where do I go? Downstream? I don't remember this at all. Halt! Who sails down the brook? Him again. Waterway troll, 400 leaf bucks. No, oh, you mean troll. <laughs> How troll? Yeah, yeah, smart and troll and gifted. My babysitter Anya always says that. Dead end, unless you pay 400 leaf bucks. Nobody sails under my bridge without paying. Oh, <laughs> river pirates. Oh, kids will be kids. 
You know, we used to cook up schemes like this, but as an adult, you have to let things like this roll off your back. But, but maybe just this once you ought to lose your patience and show that little cheeky monkey who's boss. Monkey? Little Humbert is a mouse. You kids ought to work that out between you. Uh, I'll just watch. Oh, <laughs> river pirates. How droll. <laughs> uh, I have to think of something. Again. All right. Thankfully, I have a walkthrough to tell me what that thing is. violin together with Plato. I'll tell him about it soon. Alright, thank you. Hang on. Is there anything else in there I'm supposed to do? No. Where was I? Back to Humbert. Who? What? The stupid weasel with the hat went and sneaked to you? No matter what he said, it's not true. He's a liar. Liar, I say. Really? But his brochure looks very promising. It even says that it's only a few steps to fame and a huge audience. Wait, what? Fame? What exactly does that thing say? It says that the famous Maxim Mousapon is currently in Mousewood to teach only one selected, gifted apprentice to play the most difficult to learn instrument in the world. Only one? It says here that the apprentice must be especially talented. Well, I am talented and smart. I'm smart and talented. You see? Jerry was right. Humbert, you little hooligan, you're exactly the right mouse for this. <laughs> of course! <laughs> I'm going to be a rock star! You can pass, you weird weasel. I haven't got time for you now. The next time you see me, it will be on the cover of an album or on stage somewhere, if you can afford the tickets, that is. Right, Anya? Of course, you little rascal. Well done, Jerry. You've got the makings of a true tree walker. Now we can float on down the brook. Yay. All right, well, I'm gonna leave it here for the episode. Come on. And uh, thanks for joining me, I'll see you next time.